so uh, I'm here in uh, Archway, which is a very busy uh, London area in North London. I just got off the bus and it's winter. Everybody's keeping themselves warm. But I mean, this is the second bus I took to my destination. I got into uh, one of the buses from East London and if you go to my Facebook page, I, I wrote something in my mind this morning. I had to write it because I, I'm not shaming anybody. I'm not trying to put anybody down, but I just felt I had to write it. And I wrote, I said, I, I can't, I get off my seat. Winter or no winter, I get off my seat. And I can't bear the smell because some people in this weather, they don't just bother to have their shower, they don't bother to have their baths, they don't even use the other right. And the worst thing is that you sit in the bus and, that, and there are some other seats in the bus and they come and sit very close to you. I mean, this is a country where when you open the tap, there's constant water 24 hours, 36 hours. 365 days in the year non-stop you know you have hot water you have cold water constantly and if you go to the shop there are various types of deodorants body mist everything to keep you fresh in the shop now we're gonna go to the shop we're gonna walk down to the shop and I'm going to take a video of um, where you have the hygiene section so we don't really have an excuse, especially in this part of the world, um, why we shouldn't keep ourselves clean and, you know, you know, really keep ourselves clean. So come with me. Okay, here's the uh, uh, hygiene section. We've got We've got different kinds of deodorants and they are very, very cheap. I mean, you got this 65p, you got that 54p, you got that 42p, you got that uh, 72p. And this one is uh, 48 hours. So you, you use it for 48 hours. And this is sensitive, if you've got a sensitive, since you're quite sensitive, and that's 48 hours. And this is the original one, and that's, you know, 48 hours as well. You got non body spray, which is that, you know, you know, um, you got strength for 48 hours. You know, you got, you got it all. You got, uh, you got uh, shaving gels. You got shaving blades, you got, uh, you know, foam bats and everything. So, um, when you get in the bus and people really, really stink, and it's not because they stink, that's because their personal hygiene is so poor. I, I don't get it. The, everything is available in England where they can buy from the shelf. Depends on how much they can afford and use it. And when you get home, wash your, wash your underarms, shave it before going to bed. And if you're somebody who is quite heavy on the underarms, don't repeat the same shirt or the same jumper the very next day. Simple as that. I just wish others could do this, but men and women. It's so, it's so, um, so unattractive when it happens to be a lady who, who comes in and sits beside you on the bus and you can't put your nose anywhere. Stay tuned, I'll be right back. Thank you. So hi my people, I'm back home. I got I got back home. Now this is what my brothers and my sisters, this is what we need. This is a roll-on. This is Sinex Invisible. It doesn't have any color, it's colorless, it's non-sticky, it doesn't have any odor, but it works. 24 hours is like it's it's if you look at it it's an anti parent it's a roll-on you can use that um, that's all we need and you also have 
the body mist which is water-based spray it's a light water base most of them are fruity very fruity um, soft fruit depends on the sort of uh, fruit flavor fruity flavor uh, flavor that you like it's just you know this is this is um raspberry and pomegranate it's a very soft uh, um, uh, fruit it's a body mist like when you finish having your shower you dry up you use your deodorant you can use that and you spray and i always have that in my handbag this is wax if you are somebody who uses um razor and you know that it gives you painful bumps because i know i'm allergic to razor and when i use razor it really does um, affect my skin it damages my skin it gives me bumps lumping bumps and then you have pores and then you have ingrown hair it's really really painful i try and i avoid that i use the wax you know um you use that's you have different kinds in the market and then you have the uh dove um this is a moisturizing cream this is 24 hours spray this is the original one so basically you shake it before you use it and then you spray you spray it under your underarms if that's the original one it does have the original dove cream is um um perfume with it you know so uh, some people prefer that uh, some people, uh, for me, I don't like any deodorants with a heavy perfume in it because um, I don't feel comfortable. I just, I like uh, things that are very mild and very light and fruity. I don't like things that are quite hard or strong on my body. I don't, I don't like that hard antiseptic um, um, smell or perfume with me and then in the same dove you have the new one you have the new one and this is fragrance if you look at it very closely yeah that is fragrance fragrance free is 24 hours and it is for sensitive if you have sensitive skin like me uh, your, your skin is sensitive your underarms are sensitive then you can use that now, if any of these things do not work for you, you can't. You, you can use um, ordinary lemon or lime. I'm not sure if I have any at home right now. I think I ran out of it because I'm I'm always stocking stocking the house with lemon or lime, and I I run out of it quickly because I use them a lot. I use it for cooking. I use it for everything. So basically, what you do, you've got two types of uh, lemon. You have the yellow lemon, and then you have the green lime. So whatever suits you, all you need to do is to cut the lemon in two. When you shave your arms your underarms and you clean it up right if you think it's too uh, sensitive for for that because you've just shaved i would not advise you to use the lemon because it will hurt you leave it and then in the morning um you could just uh ordinary salt ordinary salt when i say salt i mean cooking salt ordinary cooking salt that's it all you need to do is to put ordinary cooking salt um, in water put you know you put cooking salt you put a bit in your hands and put uh, a little bit of water and just rub it on your armpits it's it's um, uh, salt and lemon uh, salt on its own and lemon on its own is an um, is a natural antiseptic uh, neutralizer it doesn't have any side effect it works and make sure you wash anytime you go to the bath make sure you use soap and, and and a sponge or a flannel and if you are somebody who is sensitive to soap or it makes your skin dry there are so many different kinds of soap in the market you have the moisturizing creamy soap if it still doesn't work for you you can use a bubble bath or you can go to a health shop and buy something that is organic that you can use you know um that it is winter doesn't mean to say you should not have your shower you should not take care of yourself look this is me this is winter you know this is me this is winter i i i you you must look beautiful there are so many things in the market 
If you cannot afford it straight from the shop, you go to the charity. There are wonderful things, beautiful things in the charity. Just because it's in the charity shop doesn't mean to say it has been overused. Some people buy things and they drop new things there, you know. So, um, you know, whatever suits your taste, whatever you can afford, go for it. Because, you you know, you really, really, really get fed up of when you um, go, you're going out, you're dressed, you have used your perform you're going to work or you have an appointment somewhere you sit in the bus and somebody comes in not children i mean not children these are full grown adults they come inside the bus there are so many seats and they would decide that is when they actually decide to come and sit near you and you know that when they have that toxic rusty mucky hard uh, stench coming from them if if they walk past you, it, it smells, it sticks, it sticks, it goes on. And and even if you walk past there 30 minutes later, you will know that person has walked past there because the smell never really, really, really goes. And that is why I always have my body mist with me in my bag, in my handbag. Uh, yes, I always do have my body mist with me in my handbag because... Sometimes you get in the bus and that's the only available seat and you're going to work because where I work, I can't park my car there. So there's no point. And when you pack it there, you're spending like eight pounds uh, a, a, just to use a parking space in a day. It's so expensive. And my organization, your whatever, maybe your the company you work for will not reimburse you that money. So by the time you calculate it, you're spend, spending too much on, on, on a parking space just to park. So there's no, you, there's no point taking your car. Uh, you leave your car home. You use public transport which is a lot easier and that's it i always have that body mist even if, if you cannot afford to buy body mist ordinary lemon lemon you you you, you squeeze a bit of lemon in water ordinary water and put it there and slightly spray it or you know spray it on yourself and and throughout the day you smell so nice so my dear people these are the things you, available in the market that you, you, you um that you can buy and the thing what's so unattractive about it as i have mentioned before is particularly when it happens to be a female a lady and they sit near you and especially in this weather where you're having where you're wearing all these beautiful all these jumpers because they are wool and they are thick and they are meant to uh, keep you warm it 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 soaks in and retains all the body sweat and body odor so even if you washed it and you wore it for the first time and you're somebody who is quite heavy on that mucky uh, side a sweaty smell and you you come home you put it somewhere and some people will, will come home put it somewhere after work the next day they put the same clothes on and the smell only gets worse and one thing about uh, uh having that uh rusty rusty hard toxic uh uh underarms uh, uh odor is that it 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 no it never goes if you don't treat it it all has to do with personal hygiene and you know one thing about it all you need is this i mean i can't understand why some ladies would dress so nice they have a posh car they live in a very good apartment they have good jobs and they sit with you and you are looking for where to put your nose i'm looking for where to put my nose i have i have my body mist i have another spray in my bag that is why sometimes when i get in the bus and i sit and you can tell that the person who sat in that space oh my god i i just i i, I stylishly uh without feeling uh patronizing anybody or um offending anyone i stylishly bring out my body mist or my body spray and spray it all over me so it's not like i'm spraying on around the chair so that i don't offend people because people get easily uh, uh, offended these days you even on every good morning if uh, people get easily offended i just i spray myself i spray my body so that i am inhaling that my my body mist i'm inhaling my body spray and not the the stench so i just want to use this opportunity winter or no winter hamatan or no hamatan my people these are not children you are grown up men and women with your posh car with your posh house which uh, your high standard 
please it only takes less than a pound in london and i'm sure if it takes less than a pound in nigeria you have all sorts in fact you have more things in nigeria than here so it's cheap whatever you want to go for if you want to go for this if you want to go for lemon if you want to go for ordinary cooking salt and water please do eh? please you know it's 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 um a bit of an embarrassment and quite difficult to tell somebody about their personal hygiene because they might get offended and take it the other way. So I'm sorry, I don't mean to offend anybody. Uh, I just thought I should make this video. You know, my channel is an educational channel. I'm not perfect. I have I've said that before. Leave your messages. I have, I'm going to put my email in the video. Email me and inbox me your messages. And we address that. You know, we are here to learn from people. Whether you comment, you don't comment. Whether you like, you don't like. Anything you say or do, you know, is important. See, always remember to press the red button on the right of your screen, the bell button for notifications. In that way, you know, when I go live stream or when a new video has been uploaded, Remember to share this video with your neighbors, family, and friends, and your children. And that way we keep our educational mainstream and rolling in our communities. That is what we call positive awareness. Always remember to uh, like by pressing the thumbs up. And even if you press the thumbs down, leave a reason and we will address it. Remember, we are here to learn. Thank you very much. It's your favorite titi, your favorite babe on personal hygiene in a public space. Thank you very much for tuning on to my channel. Until our next video, I say love and peace.